Some researchers never set foot outside their lab. But for Dr. Fabrice Calmel, associate researcher at the Yukon Research Center at Yukon College, the whole world is his lab, or at least a very large and very cold piece of it. Dr. Calmel is one of the lead researchers for the Northern Climate Exchange, a research partnership dedicated to the study of climate change in the Yukon and Northern Canada. The goal of the exchange is to create a credible and independent source of information, which can help promote the long-term preservation of Canada's northern regions and their unique people, resources, and communities. As the exchange's resident expert on permafrost, Dr. Calmel has been tracking the profound impact that the deterioration of permanently frozen ground in the north is having on both the natural ecosystem and the people who live there. Dr. Calmel's team is also working with the Yukon and Northwest Territories Departments of Transportation and Public Works to monitor the sensitivity of permafrost along the fabled Dempster Highway. When it is complete, the multi-year study will enable transportation planners and practitioners to more efficiently plan the future construction and maintenance of highways across the North. L'équipe de Monsieur Calmel travaille aussi avec les ministères des Transports et des Travaux Publics du Yukon et des Territoires du Nord-Ouest pour vérifier la fragilité du pergélisol le long de la célèbre route de Dempster. Une fois achevée, cette étude pluriannuelle aidera ceux qui planifient et utilisent les transports à préparer plus efficacement la construction et l'entretien des routes qui sillonnent le nord. But in order for his research to be effective, Dr. Calmel requires a huge amount of data collected from across 2,000 kilometers of inaccessible terrain and more than a decade of research into everything from soil conditions to changes in the core thickness of ice. To collect, amass, and store all that data, Dr. Kalmal depends on the security, performance, and tools provided by Canary and the Yukon Research and Education Network, operated by Yukon College. In Dr. Kalmal's words, Canary is the oil in the gears. In addition to giving him direct, high-speed access to all his data, whether he's out in the field or back in the lab, the Canary Network also lets Dr. Calmel share that information with policymakers, infrastructure groups, First Nation organizations, and other stakeholders anywhere in the country.